Right, let's figure out uh, where we are. Oh, a nice cold hard crash on this Friday afternoon. I could go for a, I could go for a cold hard crash. Let's do it. We. We should fall asleep outside in the snow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, death platform. Okay. Well, I've got the controller, so... Death platform, Oops. don't fuck it up, Charlotte. Death uh. platform, no death platform. <laughs> whoa! Oh. Whoa, whoa, wee-wa. Whoa, whoa. Wowie-wee-wa. Robbie Rotten. <laughs> oh, I haven't heard Rob Robbie Rotten in a good while. <laughs> Everyone loves Robbie Rotten. Everyone, he was the best part of Lazy Town. He and was, he was always my favourite. And we had to watch it when we were babysitting your uh, your little brother and sister. I yeah. always loved watching, um, I always loved watching the adventures of Robbie Rotten. I didn't care whatever Stephanie was doing. Everyone else sucked. Like, everyone else was so one-dimensional and lame. The villains are always the best characters because they're flawed. Yeah. That's why everyone likes Team Rocket the best, because they're, they're real. Ash is like just this perfect little man, right? The, the best things about Ash's character, I should say, are like when he loses things and, you know, he's not just this infallible main character. Yeah. The best parts are when, um, when he's a real little boy. He's a real boy. Go! Woo! Oh! Oh, that's well, a death. there goes the death platform. Oh, we're almost out of lives. Oh, damn. Is that intentional? No, it wasn't intentional. <laughs> Crash is always really difficult to control on the ice. He's got weird physics on it, he always has. I'm not sure if there's like an ice level in a game that I like. Mario Galaxy has good ice levels. Oh, it does. Because they made Mario control really good. He controls like an ice skater. He, he moves like one as well. I remember seeing it just like, ooh, look at him. Yeah, it's definitely the right thing to do. Stop making characters control bad on it and make them control good on it. Yeah. I know you make a different game when you do that. You make different problems to solve. But it's more fun. I, I've never played a better ice level than in Mario Galaxies. Whichever ones did it better. I remember liking Mario Galaxy 1. Um, I think I might like it more than the second. I, I like Mario Galaxy 1 more than 2. 2 leans too much onto Yoshi, and I know he was the main gimmick for it. I like everything about, like, the hub world and stuff less as well. Yeah. I don't like the little face ship Mario. Whoops. Oh, oh. oh we needed him. Well, I, I didn't mean to do that. What was I supposed to do? <laughs> May as well not waste a life. No, it's true. I'm gonna get this no done, death done, diddly death done, dub. Dub. <laughs> I'm gonna get this no death platform and then I'll pass it off. Because these suck. Yeah. What sucks about this one is it doing this way. I don't even know if the no death platform is a crate challenge necessarily. I don't know if you should be doing it. Yeah, but we're not gonna know until so, we until do it. Until we've done it, so I'd better just do it, haven't I? Yeah, and it's like, I don't wanna like look it up. It's like, where are all the crates in Crash Bandicoot? Where are all the wins in Crash Bandicoot? I don't want to play the game, I just want to look at a tutorial. Oh man, why do people play games like that? I don't know. I, I heard so many people saying that about Crash, um, Crash 4. Oh yeah, man, the game's great to play, but don't try and complete it. And I tried to complete it, and it's not that fucking bad. Like, once you learn the language of the game, which is, if there is an obtuse way to hide something, it will be there. Like, that's not very good, I admit. But once you learn that, it's not actually very hard to compensate for. Yeah, like, you start you... seeing the patterns and where they're hiding them. Yeah, just like in this game. You know how in this game, because sometimes they'll hide boxes way up off screen, I always bounce extra high off of things. Yeah. There's just more things like that to learn to do as you play Crash 4. It's not that big a deal. No, it's really not. Like, it's the same with any game. Like, I don't hear people that complain about it in, like, Dark Souls. And this is the Dark Souls of video games. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh. that's what I wanted to see if it would happen. Ah, okay, that's, keep that in mind. Hey, in the original, these are reflective. They are, yeah. Games are scared to put reflections in them anymore, and I don't know why. Me either. It's like, oh, here's a mirror, but it's all foggy. It's like, why? So they don't have to render it, <laughs> because they think, for some reason, people think doing the tricks that the old games used to do is bad. Like, how they used to do reflections in Crash 1 is there was just another Crash who mirrored your movements. There was just oh. another character model on that side. Oh, there was just, like, a character model running parallel to you. Yeah, underneath. That's all it was. And people are really scared to do that now for some reason. If it works, it works. And it like, does work. Yeah. Nothing's done it better. Like, that's how Portal's made. The whole game is that. Just rooms next to rooms. And... Yeah, when you make a portal, it cr recreates the whole room you're in. That's why it lags sometimes if you fuck it up a little. Yeah. Oh, uh, me wumpers. Oh. oh. This wumps. Shit. 
does wump. I don't know if you have to watch him explode or not. You did in the originals. You could get too far away. Oh, sliding on it breaks it. Oh, no. I didn't think it would. My bad. Okay. Just, I... I knew sliding into it would. I didn't think sliding on it would. Yeah. In the original, you could get too far away from these and they wouldn't blow up the crates. Because, um, like, they'd be out of the render distance of the game. Yeah, so the game's just, like, so, not, not important, it's off screen. That's probably not an issue anymore, but it, I, it's ingrained into me. Hell yeah! Whoa! I'm um, Crash! Instead of playing it, we watched um, the Only Plays guys play the, uh, play the, the original, original Crash 2. And uh, they never once had these weird little slip problems that we're having. Like, when you jump at the edge of these things, you just go off. Yeah. You know, they had other problems that Crash Bandicoot has. They didn't have that one. Uh, one nice thing I will say about the remake, the, the bouncy boxes, it takes significantly less bouncers to get rid of them. Yes, that's a really big improvement. I think we've probably talked about that on like Crash 1 or something. We might have, yeah, but just to, oh jeez, just to reiterate. Oh yeah, it's uh, it's the correct change, isn't it? Yeah, like don't waste my time having me jump on it ten times if five times is, is sufficient. Yeah, well what they do is they, um instead of you having to bounce on the thing ten times, you bounce on it five and you get two fruits out of it per bounce. And um, there is that thing there, don't yeah, forget that. I won't, I won't forget that. I'll I don't know where the it. button is, don't forget it though. But, oh, get out of here, Sonic. Okay, you can only run on the ice bit. Oh, that's odd, we're the opposite. Ooh, <laughs> I don't know why that worked. <laughs> should I break that? I think I should. I, I think break that now. I'm gonna have to come back. Oh. Oh, it slid me yeah, in. Yeah, you were out of that. Yeah, crap. Look, look, his momentum is crazy yeah. on these things. Like, I, I think just go slowly on them. It means you can go really fast and it's fun, but I'm scared. Yeah, we don't want to die. Oh, so Nitro, you would have run into that. Oh my god. It's going to make me go backwards through the Nitros. Yeah, it is. Come on. Is this the one that I should run That's under? the one you've got to run under. Ah! Oh. What, oh, what do I do about that? That's evil. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what do you do about that one? Yeah. There is some improvements in this game. Like, it's it's obvious, but mm, there should be more. There should be more. Especially about the hitbox Ooh. thing. Ooh. I looked up mods on the PC version. Oh. There's, like, restoration mods that, like, make Crash the correct colour and stuff. Other people noticed that one. <laughs> nice. There's ones that add the old music and sound effects because they're better. Oh, that's nice. And they are better. We watched the bee level yesterday on the old one. Like, you yeah. can hear where the bees are. Yeah, you can hear the bees. It made the bees much easier to deal with. We didn't have the volume very loud, and we could still hear the bees really well. I really do think lives don't add a lot to Crash Bandicoot. They, they don't really add anything. Woo. They removed him in Crash 4, and it's better. You can put him back on, and why would you want it? Is my opinion. Yeah, unless you're going for, like, I'm never gonna die kind of run. Well, then but... why would you anyway? Proof? I, I don't know. <laughs> the proof should be that you beat the game. No one's going to believe you without recording it, you know? That's true, yeah. <laughs> oh, can I go? Yeah. Why did he do that? I don't I, know. I, can someone explain what Crash's ice physics are? I've never understood them. Oh, okay. oh. Oh, See, I don't oh. know why he slides backwards like yeah. that. Yeah. No, don't do that. No. You need some speed, but don't go too fast. Yeah. Wait. No. Oh. Oh. Oh! That's it, that's it. If we're coming back for that, I'm just gonna get him later. Yeah, that's fair. Let's see if we can actually get back here. <laughs> okay. No! Oh, that's so mean! Oh! Fuck that level. Let's do that later. We don't have enough lives. Yeah, alright. Well, I don't know if I want to do I, that one. Yeah, okay, not... we're going back to this one. Yeah, I don't think I'm ready for another B level. Oh yeah, you've actually seen what the penguins look like now. Yeah, yeah, I've seen them in the original. The penguins are so much nicer in the original. Everything is. Everything's got these horrible spore creature creator eyes in this one. It's a really good remake, usually. That part, objectively not better than the original. Like, we saw the original yesterday. Charlotte doesn't have nostalgia for it. It no. looks better. It just does. Everything's more readable. The lighting's better. How'd you get the lighting worse? Yeah, well, you, well, you've got more lighting capabilities. It's like the, the projector, the Cortex projector, actually looks good, doesn't it? Yeah. It's got little lens flares as that little camera thing circles around the room. It looks good. Like the flickers of it, they're like really prominent, so you know it's like the projector. It <laughs> it, yeah. It sells it so much better. Yeah, it does, because someone actually tried. Like that's the difference between it being someone's oh. passion. No. no! 
That's the difference between it being someone's passion project and it being someone's job. Yeah. Someone wanted to make Crash Bandicoot 2 and someone else was hired to make a remake of Crash Bandicoot yeah. 1, 2 and 3. <laughs> you know, that's literally all the difference is. Yeah. Oh, this one's fucking annoying. Yeah. <laughs> to put that box right next to a cliff, it's, that's not fair, man. What is that's with that like, momentum? That's like consistent. You can't plan things around him when he moves like that. I don't know what dictates where Crash's momentum lives and dies. That's a really huge problem in a game about controlling someone. Stop making oh. him jump! Whoever thought Nitros should jump is a fucking idiot. There's no polite way to say it. Yeah, it's like, oh, what if this thing that will kill you moves? Look, animate them so they bop around like that, but don't actually change their hitbox. Don't lift them off the ground by a full fucking tile or more. What am I supposed to do about that? Yeah, like, there's no indication as well, like, because it's just a box. It'd be so easy just to make it better, but they didn't because it wasn't their passion project. It was a job. They got hired to do exactly what they were hired to do, and then they left. They went home. Yeah. They didn't think about it anymore. Anyway. I did it. I made a penguin. Job well done. I remade Crash, just like my boss told me. No! Oh, oh that's it. I want to stop. Okay, that's fine. I'm glad those metal. Yeah, imagine if they weren't. <laughs> no! Oh. I remember this was my strategy when I played this, when I replayed this. It was just like, this part sucks. Yeah. I never 100 percented Crash 2 on the PlayStation because I didn't own it. Oh yeah, you said like you uh, got it from friends and stuff. Yeah, I'd borrow it from people. Yeah. There we go. I bet if I keep jumping on this, he'll fall. That'd be nice if he did, because then he wouldn't slip anyway. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. Okay. Alright, okay. we're here. We're here. Oh, extra life. That's quite nice. Yeah, that's the one that you get back. Oop. Ooh, jeez, no. that would have sucked dick. That's everything there. Checkpoint. Oh! oh. I hope we didn't miss one. I really hope we didn't miss one. I don't think we missed one. It looked like you got them all. Looks can be deceiving. They can. Oh, come on! That's evil. That is bullshit. I can't see that. Uh, uh. Okay. Whoa. Okay, okay, is that full? Is that full? Is that full? It's what? Well, we're not 100%ing this game. We'll just play on my file at the end. Yeah, okay. Oh no. When you get on that death platform, you have to go all the way right, break all the boxes, come back to the death platform. No. Not doing it. Sorry. It's a really good game. It's just fucking stupid on occasion. And like, you could have. What? Was, what? There, was there a TNT or Nitro that I couldn't see because boxes were in the way? There better not have been. There was, there was a bot. Yep, yeah, there's a nitro. There's a fucking nitro. There's a nitro right behind it. This game's shit all of a sudden. 